Hello world, this is Denver or Misty Valley Paramount. This is my third version of Lady Gaga's Born This Way, by far the best version so far. So if you want to see a tutorial on how to get this look, then definitely keep watching. And oh, by the way, this was inspired by a look done by O. Gotham on YouTube. I will have a link to him below and he's a really really cute guy from Florida. So this is inspired by that and Lady Gaga's Born This Way video and vamped up in my own style. I hope you enjoy. For foundation I am using Color Stay by Revlon number 180 and I am using a 186 dual fiber brush from MAC to apply. I am going to stipple it on first and then I am going to buff it in. To create the horns, I'm just going to etch a quick triangular shape right here and I'm going to keep the color in and trying to create a slightly solid line on the edge. When you're creating these shapes, you want the highest point to be the whitest or to be the brightest. Gaga's horns on her face weren't curved down here at all. It was perfectly straight. However, when you get to her horns up here, they curved slightly. So she had a slight horn curve at the very top, and then it goes down and inwards. And then this one, I'm actually just going to pull it so that it curves down and around. Once you've got your highlight on, you want to go through and create your low light. Keep in mind that this is going to stick above on this side here, so we don't want to create a shadow so much on this side, just underneath and on top slightly, to give it the illusion that it's sinking back down again and sinking back down again. Yet this highest point here is going to stick out and it's going to shine beyond the actual face itself. So we want to make it very concentrated here and blend out more here. I'm also going to highlight my jawbone, just right here, and I'm going to blend everything together. I'm now going to contour off the corner of my jaw ever so slightly. And I'm going to highlight it as well. I want to give the illusion of a slightly higher jawbone by highlighting just right here. which makes this appear as a jawbone and not this as a jawbone. For the eyes, I'm just going to create a dramatic inner crease
Oh, I need fuel for my mule, or gas for my ass. Fuel for my mule, gas for my ass. So for her look, we're going to start a dramatic wing from the inner corner all the way to the outer corner. We are actually going to follow this right up to right past the eyebrow. We are going to wing this down and I'm going to fix the line as well. I just want to get a fairly sharp point to it. It doesn't have to be a perfect point, but if you can get it that way, do it. I'm going to create a thicker line here going down to a very thin line at the inner corner. I'm going to bring the bottom corner and connect that as well and I'm going to fill in everything that's left. With no bumps, no grooves. Using Feline by MAC I'm going to fill my waterline using a dark color once again I'm going to create a very slight brow right here and I'm going to pull that black color slightly forward slightly back just to soften it lastly I'm going to conceal my lips apply a clear nudish pink gloss and that will be the end of the look And I lied, the last step is to apply mascara. I'm going to apply mascara and then I will be back. At this point, especially if you're going out, take a very good, hard, long look at your artwork. And if you need to change something, change it now. Even things out that you need to even out. And heaven forbid, don't forget to fix your lips. I'm going to shape my lips a little bit more like Gaga, basically just slightly bigger than my own. Gaga has been wearing some really, really big lips, so this is why I've made mine so big. I am darkening here because I want the whole side just to drop off and go back. And likewise, right here, I'm going to do the same, and I'm going to blend it upwards. This is going to create the Gaga shape to the face as well. And that's everything. I hope this was helpful and enjoyable to most of you. And until my next video, I hope you all have amazing days. Bye.